Isn't this fun? Now, this is where we get to the names. It first started out as the Project 9910 mm. or WZ123. Mm. Uh, in Australia, we call them Zs, not Zs. Sorry. So for any uh, uh, overseas people that uh, might, want, might want to say, what's a Z? Although the Sesame Street effect means that enormous generations of Australians have grown uh, up with kids. Z. Uh, the WZ123, and then in prototype phase, was called the, the Type 99. Uh, then the Type 99, 98, sorry, first called the Type 98, then the Type 98G. Uh, went for five years uh, as prototype. Um, the tank was trialled in all terrain over China with uh, the four prototype tanks built, driving over 20,000 kilometres and firing 760 rounds each. Um, oh, each. Having met or exceeded the testing requirements, it was given into given the green light to go into production, which was when it was then uh, renamed as the Type 99 or the Type 99A1, which is different from what became the Type 99A. Yeah, so there is a line of thinking in some quarters that the Type 99A1 is what we would call the Type 99, and the Type 99A2 is what we call the Type 99A. But we're just going to keep going with Type 99 being the first derivative and Type 99A being the more modern one. 